Sushi for the gate to shift their turns. Today we're out here at Doksugung Palace. This is just another palace that we decided to check out. This one's significantly smaller than the other ones, but it's still pretty interesting. So we're here to check it out and see what there is. We just found this little pond area down here. It's pretty mucky, but still cool. Now that we're done in the palace and we picked up a few things, we're just wandering around here to find some lunch. if you can hear me right now but if you can now that we've gotten some food at a nice restaurant we're at this middle strip here between these buildings to look at some statues and there's also some nice water fountains here too so. That was fun. Got to try some hanbok. It's the traditional Korean clothing. So that, they just had a little stand up there. Tried that out. Now we're gonna rest up because this evening we're going to a baseball game. We're out here now at the baseball stadium. We're just getting our tickets so we can head in. These ladies back here are stopping everyone, offering them tickets. And we got offered some, but we had no idea what was happening. So that was interesting. Um, but anyway, we're about to head in, probably get some food and watch some baseball. Superheroes. One thing we're finding is that every single player for the team has their own theme song that everyone sings along to. Games 
are very uneventful, but the fans do not care. game you can get a little glimpse of what it's like to go to a baseball game in here in you can get a little glimpse of what it's like to go to a baseball game here in Korea so you can see very different from in the United States the games often aren't that exciting but the people are fun to watch definitely an interesting experience totally recommend going to a Korean baseball game um, so now it is time to find the subway and head back to the hotel and turn it in for the night. See you tomorrow. Yay!